Hey everyone, it's Elias with RV Simple Life. We're at our very first harvest host. Uh, we're here near Macon, Georgia at Lane Southern Orchards. And uh, this is a fabulous place where there are several um, other RVers here right now. So I'm gonna show you around just a little bit. RV Simple Life. We're at our very first harvest host. Uh, we're here near Macon, Georgia at Lane Southern Orchards. And uh, this is a fabulous place where there are several um, other RVers here right now. So I'm going to show you around just a little bit. I have a nice little picnic area here to be able to relax a couple swings back there to enjoy as well little kids play area over there we're gonna get a little closer to that and take a look at that it's a nice little kids area for kids to play enjoy stretch your legs they've been in the RV for a while a couple of vintage tractors here to look at as well oh it's nice they have a fact sheet here on them. John Deere. And then Allison Chalmers. And they have a bigger picnic area over here. I'm not sure if this is something that we are able to use or not. It's got a kitchen area back there in the back. So it's very nice also. And over here is you pick strawberries. There's our rig back there in the corner. You pick strawberries. Big, big property. To you, um, if you have not tried Harvest Host in the past, I'd encourage you to try it out. Uh, you can get a, a good deal on it actually with 15% off uh, if you want to use the code uh, in the description. 
um, right below here, we're below the video, that'll save you 15%, but uh, a great value. You stay there two or three times and that has paid for uh, your entire membership for the year. And you know you can, you can go from Harvest Oats to Harvest Oats as long as there's availability. And some of them like this, this one here has uh, several spots to be able to park. And so uh, a great, great value. So I'm very happy with Harvest Oats and this is our first one we've been to. And so uh, I, I'm enjoying it here. I have enjoyed it since I've been here for a few hours and looking forward to being able to see some things tomorrow while I'm here. So. All right, we're here at Love's in Central Ohio, and I am about to, uh, here's Love's. We're about to uh, weigh the truck and trailer for the first time. You see it over there between all the rigs. So we're gonna do this the first time, cat scale over there. Okay, I'm gonna pull up here. Here, I'm gonna call her right now. All right, I'm gonna go drop the trailer. I'll be back with just the truck. Thank you. There's a the truck on the scale. There's a trailer over there. It looks kind of sad, but all by itself. It, looked, it, it says, if it could speak, it's saying, what am I doing over here with all these dirty trucks? Okay, we're all back together now. We're gonna head inside and see Maya. I just finished up on the scales there. Okay, I just got back inside here. This is our, our scale um, slip for the truck only, right there. And the truck's weighing in at 9,060 pounds. That's pretty heavy. Um, that's with nothing on the truck at all. And uh, like I said, it's uh, the fuel right here. Uh, it's got more, well, it's about seven eighths of a tank, I guess. Yeah. So, truck with the pin on the with the pin weight on there, 12,400. So, if I took the truck off. This is the truck with the pin weight. Um, if I took the truck off of 9,060 pounds off this, so we're at 9,060, uh, 10, 11, 12, so we're at 3,340 pounds are on the pin. 3,340 pounds, which is fine. So I'm happy with the pin weight, but the one I'm not happy with is the total weight. This is the truck and full trailer. We're at 28,120 pounds. Um, 28,120 pounds, which I think we're over. Um, actually, if you take off the truck, 28,120 pounds, you subtract the truck, let's just say, let's just call it 9,000 pounds, you know. Um, now we're at 19,100 pounds, let's say. 19,100 pounds and I believe the trailer says 19,120 pounds right here says 
says gross vehicle weight rating is 16.8 and we're at 19,100 pounds right now. So we're overweight. I thought we were overweight. I felt like we were overweight. So uh, we're over 2,000 pounds overweight right now. So not good. I'm going to drop this water. sure how much water is in there but we're gonna drop that so, so gross vehicle weight rating 16,800 uh, when your unloaded weight is 14.7 your axles each can carry 7,000 pounds so you're able to put the difference between the unloaded and the loaded weight 14.7 and 16.8 that's roughly 2,000 pounds of stuff you can have in here we have another 2,000 pounds worth of stuff. So we're way overweight. We need to uh, really get get some of the stuff out of here that does not need to be in here. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side our fears are done. All the good times just begun. We know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy, but things are finally right With you and I, the future is bright Crazy, but things are finally right 